everybody. I know it's been a long time since you guys have seen me. Let me adjust this a little bit. It's been a long time since you guys have seen me. I've been sick. I've actually, I had COVID. I got COVID um, last Saturday. Um, but um, I got tested on Monday and it was positive. So I've been home and extremely bored. Um, I purchased some things, you know, um, but I was like, well, I better start making more videos. Um, today is Saturday. Um, I will be returning to work on Tuesday. So I haven't been really very m motivated to do anything while I've been sick. The only thing that I've still been trying to keep up with, um, uh, the first few days that I was sick, I couldn't really move around very much. I mostly slept. And, um, try to make sure I drink lots of water, you know, um, do all the things that people tell you you have to do. Um, and then, um, yeah, so I, the main thing that I've been trying to focus on is, um, getting the hydration, keeping up with my, um, it's not necessarily a diet, but with my health regimen that I've been, been going on so far. The funny thing is, is like you're home for all this time and you, the places that you want to go, you can't go. So m one of my biggest, m one of my favorite places to go, which I, I think this is where I got COVID, um, is, um, the gym, um, and to work. Um, work is pretty much where my people are that I socialize with. Um, and then I think the reason why that I got it at the gym was because I really just haven't been paying attention to, um, washing my hands. Um, and then on Saturday, see, they say that you can't get COVID right after being exposed to it. I don't know. I have no idea, but I was cleaning. I was helping to clean. I live in a mobile home park. And so I was helping to clean one of the station, one of the spaces that we have here so that somebody new could move in. And, um, I mean, they had old wood that we tore apart and we had, there was a whole bunch of stuff that, that was there that, that, you know, like it was not good stuff to be exposed to. And I didn't wear my mask. So, um. It wasn't something that I even thought of, you know, because it was outside. Although, in hindsight, I should know better. For my immune system, I should know better. Um, so, I've learned a lot of quick, hard lessons. Um, the one thing that I'm thankful for is that um, California still has the COVID time. Um, so, I wasn't, I didn't lose any pay. So that's one thing that I'm very grateful for. Um, I could have used my vacation time, but then I would have used all of my vacation time. So anyways, I've been just like thinking about, you know, what kind of videos I can do for you guys and stuff like that. So I got a few things while I've been sick. I didn't think this one was actually going to come before I went back to work. So it's a, it's a, um, where's the paper? So from QVC obviously so I just got this box I just opened the top I didn't take anything out so this is called a okay so it's from a company called Cell C-E-L-L -L, oh Cella a magnetic metal kitchen and they forgot the C um, storage rack so this is pretty cool because I'll show you in a minute why why it's going to work so well. Oh my gosh, I don't have to put anything together. Huh. There's nothing to put together. So this is basically a, um, a, a metal, metal rack kind of like, right? So I live in a mobile, uh, I live in a trailer, right? So one of the things that I have that I can't do is I can't hang things. I can't, don't have, uh, like, um, the painting that you guys always see, that painting is actually hung on a, um, one of the pull handles for the, for the doors up the top. 
So um, I can't hang any paintings. I can't hang any pictures or anything like that around here. Because it's not made of stuff that like you guys have at your house. So let's see if I can. So in order to have anything. Does this go this, this way? I hope it goes that way. Alright, so instructions. So no no no. <clears throat> so this is what it looks like. So um this part right here you can either put a roll of paper towels inside here or you can um what that is. Oh hooks. Um so you can put paper towels in here or hang a dish dish towel over here. So um, I don't know what I'm gonna do just yet. But I saw it and I was like, hey, I could use that. Cause I have the metal surfaces over here. I'm gonna turn the camera around so don't be all kinds of shocked whenever you see it and it move. Okay, so there we go. And now let me lift it up so I can show you guys better. here so you guys are familiar with this area so this area right here is metal now of course I can put it over here on the um, refrigerator I can stick it right here so I'll show you guys it's got like huge I'm hoping that it works it's got huge magnets on the back of it so when you stick it ta -da! <laughs> okay so let me take this up so if you look in the space let me come over on this side if you look inside the space that I have see the distance see all this stuff and then you have a small small distance here so I'm hoping that it'll fit in this area right here on this side so Let's go ahead and, <clears throat> sorry, <clears throat> my freaking, my throat is still not back to normal. I can't taste anything. Um, it's just really kind of, it's kind of a wonky way of feeling right now. So let me go ahead and turn this the other way. Okay, yeah, that's probably, okay. So you see right here, so this is all. Stuff. The spices and everything that you have. Oh no. Okay. Alright. Had you guys like a weird angle for a minute. So the video is going to be kind of wonky. Which you guys should be used to with me. Um. So anyways I have all these spices and everything. And they, they live like right here. So if you can see it. See, like, there's this, like, little tiny alley. Move my arm. So there's a little tiny alley right here where I keep everything. So I'm hoping... I'm hoping with this... I'm going to leave it right, right there because that's where I'm working. Okay. So. Take all this stuff out. And I'll give you guys the item number, of course, once I finish with this. And then there are some spices that are over here that I don't even use. And it's just ridiculous to take up that space if you're not going to use it, right? Right. Okay, so I think, I don't think it's going to be, oh wait, I don't think there's going to be, yeah, there's not going to be enough room. So let me see if I can go under. Okay. So yeah, I can go under. Yeah, I can have it under. I think that's a good idea, but I won't be able to use this for what it's meant for. So, voila, it's magic. I'm kind of happy about this. So, because now I actually have a place where I can put things and I'll know what's here. And then I can throw out what I don't want to have over here. And then, like, instead of having the... Ooh, they actually fit up here. Instead of having them. Let's see. I got these on um, QVC too. 
if you guys are interested in this stuff. So then pepper. And then I can still fit some stuff in front of here. That's cool. I like it. I think that'll work. It's not going to go anywhere. Things on there are pretty sturdy. But yeah, I like it. What do you think? I like it. It's a lot of me in your face. Um, okay, so yeah. Um, Alright, I'm going to turn it around and go back to the front. Hi! Yeah, I have this. Oh, man. I am so looking forward to going, getting out of this house. I'm tired of being stuck inside of the house. Um, everybody's like, well, why don't you go to the park? Or this, that, and the other. And I'm like, look, you know what? I mean, all my stuff is here. Um, I don't, I'm, I'm not a person that does, um, vacations, like long vacations. I take like a couple days and then that's fine. That's good for me. Um, I don't need anything more than that. Um, okay. So we're wonky on this. Let me bring it down there. There we go. Okay. All right. So now we're back in our zone. That's really cool. I'll fix it up really nice after after I get done talking to you guys. I think it might be sticking out too far. I don't know. I'll readjust it later. So anyways, the part, um, the, the item number for this is um, K67153. K67153. And it's a C-E-L-L-A magnetic kitchen kitchen storage rack now when i purchased it uh, it was 38 dollars i got it just so that i could try and see what it was like and see if it would work for me because even if i wanted to i could stick it on the front of the stove of the oven i could stick it right on the front of there so that i would have access to everything including the bottom part um so just in case you're interested in purchasing something like that or purchasing that um and then i got a um a really cool shirt excuse me hoodie that is i got a really cool hoodie um kind of saw a little bit of it um it's um it's called logo so, oh, it's so pretty. It's tie-dyed. It's really pretty. Uh, I like it. See my muscles? Anyways. Yeah, I'm so bored. You guys have no idea. Um, this one is really nice. Um, the, the feel of it is kind of like a velour. But, what is it made of? It's kind of like a velvety, velour kind of thing. <coughs> it's by Logo, L-O-G-O, -O, Logo, from QVC. Uh, what's the... Uh, I don't know. Okay, I can't read the part number, or the item number. Okay, uh, they have, the, the lines are all mixed up here. Okay, so one of the things that I wanted to talk to, to you guys about is um, I put something on my Facebook this this afternoon about um, having COVID and learning something from it and stuff like that. Um, if you think about, because I really have nothing, had nothing, have nothing but time on my hands. I haven't gotten back on my virtual um my VR boxing yet because I just don't think my body is ready for that. I'm I want to go to the, the to the gym and do the elliptical, get myself back up to speed before I start punching things because yeah I need to do it. So, anyways, if you think about um like fruit, okay, so let's just say that. <coughs> <coughs> Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and stop this video. 
and then I'm gonna start a new video with the new top with the new topic that I want to talk about. But I thought you guys would like to see that that stuff. Um, and I'll leave the product description and the item numbers. I'll get the other item number for the logo um thing. I might actually have to do a different one so that I can actually try it on so you guys can see it. Um, I don't think I have anything else, but I'll be right back with another video. Take care. Bye.